Hey, welcome back to my channel. So I've just filmed a home bargains haul for you, hence the same outfit, and I'm now going to be doing the Kath Kidson advent calendar. So this is the beautiful calendar here. I mean, what gorgeous packaging is this? Kath Kidson do do some lovely packaging, and yeah, I thought that I would unbox this for you all so you can see what is inside the calendar. Now, Boots have um, an offer on at the moment where this has got a percentage off. Um, so it wasn't full price, which is really good. I can't really remember off the top of my head, but I'll link it below for you so you guys can go and check it out. And I'll link it to Boots so you guys can see the offer that Boots has. So let's unbox it. I'm really excited for this one. So it's got a gorgeous ribbon. I just think that the packaging just, I don't know, it'd be really nice if you could kind of cut some of that out and like, I don't know, you could use it as gift tags or something or to recycle it. I don't know, you could even frame it for Christmas, obviously without that bit, but you could do like that, that would look really nice. Okay, so, oh my god, look, guys, look at that, how cute is that? Oh, calf, what have you done, love? Right, number one. Oh, okay, so it is Kath Kidson Lip Balm. Now the packaging has kind of come up, come away there, but you can just, there we go, just stick it back down. So this is a 10 mil, I'm presuming this is like full size. Oh, that smells really nice. That smells of watermelon. Um, so yeah, there's that with the, oh yeah, it is watermelon. God, that does smell a bit. Um, so yeah, the signature kind of floral print, which is really nice. If you guys love cat kids, and I think you guys would love this, or if you know somebody who does. Um, okay, so number two. And look, these are really cute, and the actual numbers come off, so you could use these as little gift tags if you wanted to. That one does look like a tampon, so I wouldn't really say to use that one, or a sanitary pad, should I say, not tampon, but if you kind of cut the top off, I'm, I don't know what's wrong with me, I don't know why I'm suggesting all these really random things, but there we go. Oh, this is a cute print. This is a hand cream, and you get 30 ml, which is really good, and it's pink mint lemonade. Oh, that smells, sounds like it would smell lush. Okay, I can't really take off this weird thing. It's like a a soft um, covering on it, not like the metal ones you normally get. There we go. Oh my god, that smells so nice. That smells really nice. And look at the print. How cute is that? Little hedgehogs. I love that print. So you get that number two. The number three... Where is it? I mean, you know, here we go. It's quite a, quite a big one. And what's this one? This is a body scrub. I didn't know they did like body scrubs. I know they did lip balms and stuff, but not body scrubs. Let's see if I can get this out. Oh, there we go. Oh, look. So it's got um, little ice skates on, um, a robin. How sweet is that? Okay, so this is body scrub and it's in the scent. Christmas Village. Oh my god, I'm loving the sound of all of these things. Oh, that smells like that that flipping Febreze, which I'm happy. I'm all over. I'm I'm with it. Yes, well done, Kath Kitson. That is a beautiful scent. I'm loving that. Okay, and now at number four. I wasn't sure what to expect from this. So this is a hand wash. Oh, that's cool. And um, it's Christmas Village again. <gasps> Imagine this on your little sink for Christmas time. How cute would that be? Look, it's a post box with a little dog and some snow. I'm all for it. I'm there. I'm right there. Oh, come on. Just don't have those metal bits. It's really, really hard if you don't have your real nails doing the work for you. Right, there we go. Oh yeah, but it smells, smells like slightly sweet. I really, really like those scents. Okay, now number five. I wonder if they have any makeup. I don't think they probably do. So I haven't looked at the contents of this. I like to have surprises as well, as well as you guys. Um, can't really get this one out. So this is a perfect square, you see. Oh, come on. These would be such lovely gifts if somebody loved Kath Kidson. They would love this so much. Okay, guys, I can't get it out. <laughs> okay, well, it's a bath fizzer. 
wherever it is, which is really, really cute because it's got a old school car with a dog driving it, another dog in the back, and some presents on top. But I can't get that out, so when I do, I'll let you guys know. All right, number six is another body scrub. This is in Sweet William um, Plant Pots. Sounds nice. I like this, the wording of all of the um, names of all these scents. Oh, that's lovely. I can smell like lemon and mint, like herbs. That's really nice. And like floral as well. Oh, I really like that. So that's that with the little rose on it. Then number seven, I have seen that. Here we go. Number seven. Oh, this looks cute. Oh, it's a cuticle cream. How sweet is that print as well? Oh my goodness, this is so cute. It's grapefruit and ginger. Oh, I can smell that through that. It's quite citrusy, I like it. Oh man, this is... Oh yeah, I really like that, that's lovely. And a cute little size, 15 mil, you can still get a lot of use out of that. They're good sizes, okay. Um, number eight. Print. This is a lip balm again and it's in green apple. I mean look at that print. It's just so cute So let's Oh, that's so nice. That smells so good. I want to eat it. But yeah, no, don't don't eat it uh, Number nine. Oh, it's another bath fizzer. Let's see if I can get this one out Okay, the bath fizzers are really hard to get out because they're like perfectly set in <laughs> um, But there it is there. So it's just a green kind of tealy color one that looks really cool. So it's another bath fizzer. And hey, I'm loving a bath fizzer. Um, where am I now? Number 10. And there is a liquid soap. These, the packaging for the liquid soaps is really interesting. The fact that it's like this tiny, um, it's like an actual, like, you know what I mean? It's not a, <laughs> It's not a tube, like a tube of soap is quite unusual, isn't it? So this is Gardener's Club Cucumber Spa. Yes. Oh, I don't know how to take that off. That is so nice. Oh my goodness, that's so refreshing. And it's that cute little um, head job print again, which I really like. So there's that one. Now on to number 11. And this is a body lotion and it is in Cottage Patchwork. I mean, how cute are all these names? And that's the um, print there. And it's all cruelty and vegan as well, cruelty free. Oh, that's lush. That's really nice. I could smell like real floral, that is. That's really nice. With, oh, it smells like baking as well. Oh, that's lush, that is. So there's that one there. That's nice. Now onto number 12. And I've got a uh, body lotion, and this is in Gardener's Club Flowery Fruit. I can't smell that one through. Oh, that, oh my. That reminds me of sweet peas. I love the scent of sweet peas. So it is a um, blue, uh, like, polka dot print with hedgehogs on. How cute is that? Um, then we are on to number 13. Am I right? Yes, 13. And this is a hand cream. That's a cute print as well. This is a uh, plant pot, so we smelled that before, which was really lovely. This is that one. Then in number 14, uh, another hand wash. It's a slightly bigger one. Oh, look, I love the hedgehog print. It's 30ml and it's pink mint lemonade, which I really, really liked. So there's that one, which is 30ml. Then um, in number 15, I got uh, it's another cuticle cream. It's a Christmassy print and it's Christmas Village, which is I really liked. So that's it there, which is really cool. So that's 15 mil. Then in number 16, um, you get the scented soap. I don't think I can get I can't get that one up either. Can't get that one up. So that's it there, the scented soap, which is really cute. Like imagine that on like a Christmas soap dish. That would look lovely if you still had it in this packaging. Then number 17 is a liquid soap. And it is in Wild Rose in Quince. Oh, how unusual is that? So we haven't had that scent before. Oh, I really like that. Oh, do you know that reminds me of my grandparents. <laughs> they had a quince bush in their garden. Oh, yeah, that reminds me of them. So, yeah, that's really lovely. And that's a liquid soap. Then number 18. What did I 
I get in number 18? A lip balm, I really like their lip balms. Um, so this has got like a London, um, what do you call them, the guards, they're like doing a little march. And then a post box with a robin with some ivy and a little dog with some posts and it's an eggnog. How cool is that? I love the fact that they are, <gasps> oh my god that's so lush. That's like vanilla and spice and all oh, things nice. Love that, that smells divine. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna eat it as well. I love the fact that they've got like Christmassy scents, but also kind of other scents mixed in as well that aren't necessarily Christmas themed, which is really good. Um, then we are on to number 19. Ah, and this is a body lotion in Christmas Village. So I smelled that already, which I really liked. So there's that, and that is 30 ml. Then number 20, and it's another cuticle cream. And this is in Wild Rose and Quince, which I already had in the liquid soap, so that's really cool. These are really sweet, like you could give, gift some for somebody in like a cellophane, well not cellophane because that's really quite plastic isn't it, but like tissue paper or something with like a cute little ribbon, um, or put them in someone's stocking. So number 21 is a Kathy Kids and Hand Cream in Christmas Village again, which I really like that scent, so there's that for 30 mil. And number 22, another hand cream. And this is in Mini Cherry Sprig. I've not smelled smell that one. If I can open it. There we go. Oh, that's really nice. That kind of smells of like, makes me think of Holly and Ivy. Holly and Ivy? <laughs> you know what I mean. Um, <laughs> that's it there. And then at 23, it's a bath fizzer. Can I get this one out? No, I'm just gonna have to destroy the box and then just get it out. And then number 24 is a, can I get this one out? <laughs> the only problem with these plastic ones is I do struggle to get the products out. Oh gosh, come on, come on. I can't get that one out either. Um, so that was the bath fizzer, and that's for number 24, the hand cream, which is really cool because it's got a little reindeer on the snow one, it's really cute. So that was the Kath Kidson advent calendar. Now I personally think this is a really good calendar. I think you get some lovely sized products, I think you get a good range of scents, so Christmassy and also kind of ones that you could use all year round. And I think the packaging is absolutely beautiful, so I think if there's somebody you know who would love this, then I'd advise you to get it. Um, or if you love Kath Kidson, or like you know quite pretty things this is right up your street so yeah definitely a thumbs up from me i think it's lovely and i will link it below for you guys so do um go and check that out also i will pop my instagram link for you as well so you can go and check me out on instagram please do not forget to hit that like button and subscribe and i'll see you all soon take care bye